Hello guys, welcome to RoboMate. Today we are going to discuss the instructions for form filling of JEE mains 2020. So there are some big changes. Is bar pattern mein kuch bahut hi bade changes kiye gaye hain. The subject wise distribution of questions, the total number of questions and the marks are completely changed. Is bar kul mila ke 75 questions hain aur paper hoga 300 marks ka. And the pattern is 25 questions for each subject, physics, chemistry and mathematics. And those 25 questions would consist of 20 plus 5. That means 20 MCQs and 5 numerical value questions. The marking scheme for the MCQs would be plus 4 minus 1. That means there would be negative marking. And for numerical value questions, it would be plus 4 minus 0. That means there would be no negative marking for these numerical value questions. So some important points to start with. The first point, don't fill JEE mains through any other websites other than www.jeemains.nic.in. What happens is, ye hum kyon bata rahe hain? Kyunki Google pe jab aap enter hote hain, to kai sari links aati hain. And what students do is, ki jo pehli link aati hai, wo usse form fill karna start kar dete hain. And they face problems later on. Next point, there are three papers of JEE mains. Paper 1 for BE and BTEC contains PCM. Paper 2 is for BARC contains Mathematics, Aptitude and Drawing. Paper 3 is for B Planning contains Mathematics, Aptitude, Planning based questions. Students can attempt any one or two or all of the above papers. Students who want to write advanced have to clear JEE mains part 1. Important point. Examination fee for the exam is 650 for general and OBC. It's 325 for SC, ST and girls. And if you go for any two or three of the papers, then the fees would be 1300 for general and OBC and it would be 650 for SC, ST and girls. Instructions. Do not fill multiple application in case of any issue. Multiple applications will be rejected. Fees can be paid through credit, debit and net banking only. Aap usi card ka upyog kare, jisko ki aap pehle kabhi use kar chuke hai. Apply for a machine with good internet and use a scanner for scanning any photos or signatures. While you are filling the form, have your Aadhaar card and 10 certificate with you. You are not going to choose the date of exam as it will be allotted by NTA. Let's start with the application procedure. So, the requirements for your form filling. First of all, your scanned photocopy of your photograph. It should be very clear. It can be a colored or a black and white photograph. It should be in JPG or JPEG format and the size should be 10 KB to 200 KB. Keep 8 to 10 copies of the same photo for seat allocation and joining purpose. A scanned image of your signature in JPG or JPEG, the size should be 4 KB to 30 KB. A valid email ID and phone number for the purpose of communication. A debit credit card or net banking account for the fee payment. Look, the thing is that when you go scanning, ke liye jayenge, so either what you can do is you can take a photograph of your signature and you can take a photograph of your passport size photo and you can reduce the size or you can directly go to a person who is having that scanner or you can also use an app which is called cam scanner steps for filling form step 1 fill in the application form with basic details and note down the system generated application number step 2 complete the form with exam details step 3 Uploading scanned images of photograph and signature of student. Step 4. Make the fee payment. Step 5. Download the acknowledgement generated after fee payment and take 2 to 3 prints of the same. So let's start with step 1. Generating application number. As you would enter the website, you would see something like this. So click on the fill online application form. Please click to start your application process. You would see something like this on your screen. The left side would be new candidate registration and there are given the steps to apply online. 
and the right side is for only registered candidate sign in. You would generate an application number and password which you have to enter on the right side as shown on your screen. So click at the registration for the form filling. Read all the instructions carefully and click here for the further process. Students have to fill their details according to their 10 certificates. In case you have a clashing of the name or any spelling mistake between Aadhaar and 10 certificate, then the priority would be given to the 10 certificate. You must possess any of the one documents as shown on your screen. It can be PAN card, Aadhaar card or passport. You have to select the identity type, identification number you have to enter, might be of Aadhaar card or passport or PAN card. Generating application number. Every communication will be sent to your email ID and phone number. Please remember your email details and use same phone number till next June. Remember this password, this will be your password, all subsequent logins, even password will be required to download hall tickets and results. This password you have to write and keep it because this is through your admit card, your hall tickets, everything will be downloaded. These are the details you get, you will send it to your email ID and your parents' email ID so that you don't have any problem in the future and in case you face any problem, you will have to have these security questions. You write that security question and you write the answer that you are giving right now. It's a basically recovery process. In case you forget your password, you can recover your password from here. Okay, once you submit the details, you will be asked to review entire details. Take time and review each one of them. Above the details, you have to review. After reviewing, confirm the same and submit. Once you review, click on the final submit. ओके सो स्टेप वन कंप्लीट आपको इस तरह का एक एप्लीकेशन नंबर दिखेगा स्क्रीन पे प्लीज नोट दिस एप्लीकेशन नंबर बिकॉज दिस इज गोइंग टू बी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट यू हैव टू सेव दिस नंबर दिस विल बी योर लॉग इन आई फॉर एनी फर्दर लॉग इन्स एंड दिस विल बी योर लॉग इन आई फॉर द जे डब्ल ई मेन्स एप्रिल ऑल्सो सो यू वुड गेट अ कन्फर्मेशन ऑफ स्टेप वन वंस यू कंप्लीट द फर्स्ट स्टेप you will get an email id and a message notification for the same giving your application number step 2 complete the form state of eligibility state court or eligibility ka aapko segment dikh raha hoga see ek baat ka dhyan rakhiye your state of eligibility is the state from which you are appearing 12th irrespective of your native place ye ek bahut bada confusion rehta students ko ki main is jagah ko belong karta hu to mera native yahan ka hai to main जो है मेरी स्टेट ऑफ एलिजिबिलिटी क्या है आपकी स्टेट ऑफ एलिजिबिलिटी वो है जिसमें कि आप ट्वेल्थ क्लास दे रहे हैं लिख रहे हैं द स्टेट इन विच यू अपियरिंग क्लास ट्वेल्थ इज योर स्टेट ऑफ एलिजिबिलिटी एंड यू वुड गेट स्पेशल कोटा रिगार्डिंग दैट एलिजिबिलिटी प्लीज सिलेक्ट अप्रोप्रिएट ऑप्शन फॉर दिस कैटेगरी जनरल एस सी एस टी At the end of this, I discussed in detail about OBC, NCL, General, EWS. Complete the form, mode of preparation. This is not uh, very important, so we would skip this segment. For engineering, select BE, BTEC only. For architecture, select BR only. For planning, select B, planning only. If you want to appear for engineering and architecture, select BE, BTEC and BR both. All the three can be applied by selecting last option. Select all four options which are closest to you. Don't fill any random city like Muscat, even fourth option. You might end up getting it. Okay, so medium, your medium of appearance, English, Hindi, Gujarati. Select your medium very carefully. Complete the form, exam details. Please fill the right details during counseling. Your certificates will be verified. ये बहुत important है. कई बार students जो हैं कुछ informations गलत डाल देते हैं. लेकिन जब आप appear होते हैं interview के लिए counseling के time पे तो वहाँ पे एक-एक document physically verify होता है. तो आपको इस तरह की कोई भी mistake यहाँ पे नहीं करनी है. Because even very smallest of the mistake would be considered as a very you know big negative point for you. All 12th students select appearing in the 12th or equivalent pass status. Qualifying exam, 
एच एस सी स्टूडेंट्स सिलेक्ट दिस ऑप्शन सी बी एस ई स्टूडेंट्स सिलेक्ट दिस ऑप्शन विच इज अपियरिंग एट द राइट साइड पेरेंट्स इनकम दिस इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट प्लीज फिल द ऑप्शन हेयर गार्जियन सैलरी इज नॉट कंपल्सरी दिस इज हेल्पफुल इफ यू वॉन्ट टू अवेल एनी स्कॉलरशिप बेस्ड ऑन द पेरेंटियल इनकम इन आई आई टीज वंस यू सबमिट दिस फॉर्म इट विल आस्क यू टू चेक द डिटेल्स अगेन प्लीज चेक वंस अगेन दिस इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट क्योंकि एक बार अगर आप सबमिट कर देते हैं तो उसके बाद आप कोई भी चेंज नहीं कर पाएंगे डिटेल्स डेट यू हैव टू वेरीफाई चेक ऑल द डिटेल्स वंस अगेन वंस यू चेक द डिटेल्स क्लिक ऑन दिस सबमिट बटन नोट योर एप्लीकेशन नंबर स्टेप टू इज डन नो अगेन इट्स अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट अपलोडिंग योर इमेज स्टूडेंट्स काफ़ी गलतियां करते हैं इस सेगमेंट में वो कई बार फ्लिप इमेज डाल देते हैं कई बार उनके जो सिग्नेचर हैं वो फोटोग्राफ की पोजीशन पे चले जाते हैं फोटोग्राफ नीचे आ जाता है साइज में प्रॉब्लम होती है यू हैव टू बी वेरी केयरफुल ड्यूरिंग अपलोडिंग योर फोटोग्राफ्स एंड योर सिग्नेचर देर इज नो करेक्शन फैसिलिटी दिस ईयर प्लीज डू नॉट डू एनी मिस्टेक्स वंस यू चेक ओरिएंटेशन ऑफ इमेज एंड ऑब्जर्व क्लैरिटी ऑफ बोथ इमेज अपलोड बिफोर गोइंग टू स्टेप फोर Review your entire details along with photo again. After payment, you can't correct the details. Fee can be paid by online mode only. These are the options available. Once you select appropriate option and pay the fee, you would get this application number. Step four is done. Payment issues. In case the confirmation page is not generated after payment of fee, then the transaction is cancelled. and the amount will be refunded to the candidate account within a week even if the payment is deducted from your account but status in your application is not complete your transaction hasn't happened you will be getting your money back the candidate has to make another transaction till the confirmation page is generated but before you do the next payment take 2 hours time and do the payment again confirmation page a confirmation page can be downloaded now with all your details if you can download this your application is complete please take 3 to 4 copies of the same and submit one copy at the branch office new system query redressal system if you have queries regarding any detail you can go to this tab and add your query you can check the status of your query also but remember closer to 10 lakh people apply for jwe mains your query will be answered in a week's time obc ncl non creamy layer not all who belong to backward classes in state level can avail reservations in national front please visit website of national commission for backward classes to check whether you can avail the reservation There is 27% reservation in seats for students who belong to OBC category but for in that who belong to non creamy layer only what is creamy layer and non creamy layer creamy layer versus non creamy layer if the family income is greater than 8 lakh per annum then it's called creamy layer excluding farming it's treated as equivalent to general category in seat allocations for non creamy layer family income has to be less than 8 lakh per annum can avail 27% seats in any national front exams general ews economically weaker sections students belonging to this can avail 10% of seats in any government or aided institute following are the rules applicable for any students to avail this reservation common query my parents are yet to receive a hike should we take the certificate now and avail obc general ews reservation now see nta will not be checking any certificate now certificate will be checked by josaa seat allocation body and by concerned institute in which student is taking admission they will be providing certificate format after the result for you to submit what if i applied now and couldn't submit certificate later as per last year guidelines 
students who fail to submit the certificate will be considered under general category and he will be given seats based on the general category rank. Please note the last date for form filling is 30th September 2019 till 11.50 p.m. Date of exam is from 6th January 2020 to 11th January 2020. You can download hall tickets from 6th December 2019. Declaration of your result would be on 31st of Jan 2020. Ranks will be released only after JWE mains April. If you have any doubts, please contact your faculties, area heads for help. If you have observed any mistake in your submitted application, please contact your faculty, area head as soon as possible. Thank you.